Hey guys, this is uh, me Gajanand and you are watching Take Rudran C. Uh, in this tutorial, I am going to teach you how to display file modification date in PHP. So first we have to see what is a file modification date in PHP, right? So suppose we have a file like this of, this is index.php file and here is a date, right? Last modify, date modified on this date 4, 10, 2021. 5 pm of something right so when i uh, when i modify this file when i write something here something new in a file when save and when we refresh here you will see the date will be changed let's refresh yeah uh, it's a date is uh, refresh but it's not showing uh, any seconds and milliseconds right it's just only showing uh, hours and minutes right so we will uh, same thing we will do in a php uh, in a simple way we can get or uh, we can display uh, a last uh, uh, i mean uh, we can display a file modification date like this right in a php so let's uh, do uh, let's write a code and understand and to get and to display a uh, uh, file modification date right so for that we need one file right so let's uh, make one variable suppose file name and uh, let's uh, we have a file name test txt file dot okay let me uh, test dot txt txt so this file is not uh, exist in our project so let me create this file first test dot txt in our project here is a text file and test dot uh, uh, txt right so now we have a file right so let's check first this file is exist or not in our application right and then we will display the date uh, of uh, file modification right so let's check this file is <coughs> is exist or not so we have a function uh, which is file exist file underscore exist like this and this function will take one parameter which is file name so let's put it here and here just simply will uh, echo or a display let me put it display date of modification right so normally uh, we do like this right so we do like this date to print a date right uh, we do like this just in a normal way uh, if you want to uh, show a date or uh, current date so we will do like this so this is a function date and inside it will take uh, some parameters right so we want to uh, uh we want a day month uh, year of something right so this is a day uh yeah f and in a different format right so day um uh, year and uh, also we want a, a milli a second a minute second minute and uh, hours right so this is for hour and i for minute and s for second right so normally we will do like this to display a date but we will use another way right uh, let me first test this function uh, what is its output is so here is just simply it's showing me a current date right so this is a current date right whatever we have in our uh, uh, system uh, it will show a date like this april 10 2021 and something this is a uh, this is a time right this is second this is minute and this is hour right so in this function we will add one more function let's put the second parameter put it to second parameter which is file m time right file m time and this function will take file name and our file name is text test.txt and it will uh, store in a, a variable and we are putting here right so when we refresh let's refresh so here is a last modification date so let me put uh, something like this 
mm, yeah the file which is this file is and here is also a dot to concatenate and here as well and uh, this file was last modified was last modified eight of something and this is a date right so control s for save and refresh so test.txt here i think is a uh, no space yeah so test.txt was last modified on april 10 2021 and this is the time right so when i'm refreshing it's nothing changing right it's nothing changing changing and i'm refreshing right rapidly uh yeah you can see i'm uh, refreshing the page but the date is not changing and let's modify this file and we will see the date will change or not right so here is a uh, that file so let me zoom in and i'm adding new content content in text file txt file control s for save so this time i have modified this date and and the date uh, it will be stored inside here right so when you refresh the date will be changed right Third, uh, just remember 13 39 35 so when we refresh it will change you can see 13 43 and 59 and when again i'm refreshing the date is not gonna change right so let's uh, modify this one as well so adding yeah let's removing removing text from this file yeah let me here control s for save and refresh so guys you can see so this is very small tutorial and uh, i think let me open this again so this was very small tutorial uh, but this is very important and just remember this file this this function which is file m time and you can pass this uh, uh, file name right inside a file name you can pass file name and here is a date format so it will show a last modified date of any file right so so simple and so easy uh, you can get it right so i have taught you all the things related to file m time uh, this is very important function so you just have to uh, remember this one right so guys if you like this video please give a thumbs up and let me know what you think about this and if you have any cash questions and doubt you can write me a comment i'm here to help you i'll reply you instantly so thanks for watching once again bye bye have a nice day